I'd like to just welcome all the um, youth from, um, from the island, from up north, and um, the Okanagans, the Lillooet Stelliums. We want you to be safe while you're here. We want the chaperones to make sure that you're with them all the time, that um, we make healthy, and cho healthy choices, and that you like step out of what Craig was saying, step out of your comfort zone, go and meet the next person, and because we're from all over the place here. These kind of things and these kind of experiences of being on the land, of, of understanding that uh, our ancestors, our elders, your kids and sluts, your grandmothers and, and grandfathers, really depended on the land for a great many food foods. Like if you if you can think back to your your kids' house or your grandmother's house, some of the canned goods, the the meat, the deer, the moose, elk, fish. And when we enjoy those things, we have to also understand that those animals come from, from their home and they need land, food, water, uh, you know, the different things that they need to grow. And that's what we have to look at and protect it so that we in our time can, can enjoy the, the, the benefits of the land and carry on our traditions like to uh, again uh, thank everybody for being here uh, and enjoy yourself and, and I hope you have a wonderful time. Cook's Chapel. Well I think this conference dream catcher for the youth is really important and uh, the reason I say that is that uh, it binds youth together in a common sort of uh, if you will ideology, common purpose but also they learn from each other. I can remember when I was younger and meeting uh, young people at university same thing we were passionate we wanted to know more and when you meet other people from other nations, like what's going on here, it builds that kind of confidence and the reality is, yeah, we can do this. And I think that's what I see here is young people sort of binding together. You know, like they're doing things like uh, they're taking uh, kids, uh, the children, the youth out on the boat and fishing as an example, catching the fish and bringing them back and teaching them what to do with the fish right to the smoking of it. And those kinds of activities, and if we think about health food and the things that are sold in health food, you know, like fresh fish, you know, fresh uh, fruit, and those things that our people for generations you know, took off the land, that's our medicine. They, they may be called berries or you know, foods, but they really weren't, they were our medicine. And I think by taking our young people in that direction, showing them how to do that, by doing that, that's what is opening up, is uh, helping our young people return to the land. I think that's what we need to do. I guess as Indian people, we have everything, but we don't make use of those things today. You know, the land, everything from the land, and uh, I think that, you know, with youth like you would have gathered here, maybe those things should be discussed a little more, the importance of the land and how we can survive as people. And so once again, I'll thank Adams Lake for hosting this seminar and just to all your youth, have a great weekend. Thank you. Our elders always talk about thinking about the seven generations in the past, the seven generations in in front of us. So when you're making the decisions for today, they need to be around how are we going to take care of, you know, our fish, our, our wildlife, our deer, our moose, our elk, and the plants that sustain us. The, the elders and, and the, uh, the leadership of this community see that not only is it providing opportunity for their youth to learn about and, and re-embrace their culture, <clears throat> but at the same time it's teaching uh, officers and, and others, uh, RCMP members, such as myself, at the same time. What's up? What's your name? Kaya Ignis. That's cool. So, do you like the Dream Catcher Conference? Yeah. Totally. Do you want to come back here next year? Yeah. Do you like <laughs> the Dream Catcher Conference? So far, yeah. Uh, yeah. What are you going to come here next year? What? Are you going to come here next year? Yeah, I come here every year. What? What's the whole reason you came here for? Like, to have the fun? The uh, HAL tournament and the workshops. <laughs>
amazing, analytically I assault and I make things broken barriers bounded by the bomb Billions of broken, basically a bomb barbie Casually create catastrophes, casualties, canceling cats Got the canopies collapsing, detonated on my dang daily new window Demonstrations, don, don, don